uh, first, uh, thank you very much for all our students and uh, our staff uh, to wait for BIT. We are from Beijing Institute of Technology, and you can call me Jia Pei. And in this session, we only have 12 minutes, so um, I will divide my presentation into these three parts. The first, why BIT? Uh, we founded in 1940s, and as you know, we are one of the university in the um, Project 211, Project 985, and Double Force Rate Projects, which is all the uh, very top university uh, all in the China. And uh, I will also show you some uh, fingers of BIT's ranking. For example, in the 2018s, uh, the average research funding at BIT we ranked top two in China. The Avenue Research Funding we ranked top 10 among all the Chinese university. And BIT has received more than 130 national awards in science and technology in the past 30 years and ranked top 10 in China. And our employee rate uh, up to 97%. And for the QS World Ranking, we rank top 400 in the world. And here at least several uh, subjects uh, which are ranked top 300 in the world and they are material science, electrical engineering, electronic engineering, mechanical engineering, aerospace, chemistry, chemical engineering, computer science, information, mathematics, physics, and environmental science. Speaking of our student number, we have uh, 28,000 students for international students, we have more than 2,500 international students. And for, for example, last year, we have welcomed more than 2,500 international students from 149 countries. And uh, half of them are from Asia countries. They are from Pakistan, Kazakhstan, Korea, Laos, Malaysia, Indonesia. And we also have one fourth our students from uh, European countries, for example, Germany, uh, UK, France, uh, Russia, and uh, we have a quite a lot of students from the, and other countries. We already cooperate with more than 293 universities from 77 countries and regions. And for example, the, uh, in Europe, we have a lot of cooperation with the UK and Germany University, and also Asia in Korea, Malaysia, Thailand, and some USA university. Uh, here I list some undergraduate program can be taught in Chinese. This cover all of the, almost the engineering and science program. If you can read Chinese, you can go for apply our Chinese taught program. And also for undergraduate program, we have seven can be taught in English. They are mechanical engineering, electrical engineering, computer science, electronic science and technology, mechatronic engineering, aerospace engineering, international economy and trade. For master, we have 10 program can be taught in English and uh, the rest of the program can be taught in Chinese. For PhD, all of our PhD program can be taught in Chinese or English. So if you choose English taught program, your uh, exam, your paper, your reading list, uh, your teaching language and dissertation will be totally in English. So let's talk about some reason why we choose BIT as a nation, as an international student to study. First, for example, for our undergraduate students, uh, there will be four years in BIT. So uh, in the first year, um, we arrange all our international students study together. Uh, we will arrange some mathematics, physics, chemistry, and Chinese language class only for our international students to adapt the environment, uh, adapt the uh, study plan in Beijing and BIT. After the first year, you will go to the academic school with the uh, uh, Chinese students also. And uh, for undergraduate students, you ha will have a chance to reflect your major after first year study, both for Chinese and international students. Why are we doing that? Because we um, notice that as a high school students, you are not mature enough to choose the major you want. 
it may not be the major you really want to study. So after the first year experience, you can talk to the professor, you can talk to the senior student, you can explore in the library. So you will rethink and you will have a chance to rechoose the major and directly go to the second year. And for all our international students, you, uh, you will have, you will be over the academic counseling uh, session. And um, if you are good enough, you can, you can apply our student assistance position. So, and you will get payment. And we will have a lot of uh, volunteer work for you to do. And we have wonderful campus life and social practice. So for example, the wonderful campus life Campus Life, uh, we organize for our international students all the cultural activities every month and every weekend. Uh, there are Kung Fu class, calligraphy, and uh, culture days. And uh, for social practice, we will re uh, arrange our international students go to the, uh, for example, the form and the high tech uh, company visit and also the job fair. So next, let's talk about the job opportunity for international students at BIT. From this chart, you will say that, uh, for example, last year, we already, we almost arranged the job fair only for our international students every month in semester. Uh, so all the company is, we already select all the companies. So they have ability to give you working visa after you graduate. So you can choose working in China or working outside of China, and you do not need to compete with the Chinese students. So this job fair is only for our international students. So no matter which year are you in, you are free to go uh, to the job fair, bring your question and bring your CV, talk to the company directly. And we have cooperate with uh, a lot of company in China or outside China, for example, the Great Wall Company, which is the uh, biggest SUV company in China, and Huawei, Jindong, and many other international companies also. And here I will give you some example where are our international students going after graduate. So for example, we have uh, Nice, she's from Kazakhstan, and after graduate, uh, she worked in the Xuzhou construction machinery in China as a project manager. And also we have William and Dimas. These two students are from uh, Indonesia and they all choose to go back to Indonesia. W one of them working in the China Railway Engineering Group, one of them uh, working in the OPPO in Indonesia. And we have Miguel, he's from Spain, and uh, he is a PhD student. After graduate, he works in the Airbus Beijing Engineering Center as a researcher. And we have uh, quite a lot of students in computer science software and information, and they are in Huawei in different departments and different positions. So the, um, in the last, I will talk about how to apply to BIT. So firstly, uh, our guideline for a uh, scholarship, if you want to apply scholarship for master and PhD, unfortunately we are already closed for this year, but for undergraduate, we are still open until July of 13th, because this is, is very special. We already postponed our deadline for undergraduates. And you do not need to send hard copy to us. Everything will be online. And uh, for example, you can log in this system and register after the initial review, you need to pay the application fee online and we will arrange the online interview. If you pass the interview, you will get pre-admission notice and uh, you pay the deposit online to university and then you get, finally you get admitted. And for undergraduate, because I just mentioned for master and PhD, uh, the, if you want to apply a scholarship, it's already closed for this year. Uh, for undergraduates, we have, still have some seats uh, if you want to apply. And uh, also we will have seats for if you want to apply scholarship. So what you need to send us uh, on, on website or online is your passport copy, ID photo, high school graduation certificate, high school transcript, and we do accept the international standard 
tests such as SAT, ACT, IB, A level, or national exam in your country. And for Chinese TOEFL program, uh, we need HSK five or above. For English TOEFL program, we need TOEFL or else. And if your age are under 18, we need you uh, submit more documents you can download here. And if you want to apply BIT Freshman Scholarship, you need to fill the form. The form link is here also. So next, we talk about the BIT Freshman Scholarship for undergraduate students is still open and you still have time to, to apply this. Uh, in BIT for undergraduate students, we have two scholarships. One is Freshman Scholarship is only cover the full scholarship full tuition and half tuition for the first year. And uh, uh, it will be decided if you get the scholarship or not, according to your GPA, your transcript and your interview performance. So after first year, you are welcome to apply scholarship year by year, every year. So in the third, uh, second, third and fourth year, you can apply the scholarship according to your previous year's GPA. So um, it's have a, have a, you also have a chance to apply the scholarship every year. So in four years, you also have a chance to get a scholarship for four years. And uh, the last is our contact information. Uh, if you have any questions, you can contact China Admission. Okay, thank you for listening, bye.